This is a quick tutorial that shows you how to effectively copy and paste tables and graphs uh, from a SPSS output file into a Microsoft Word document. Um, and I should say that uh, this problem, uh, there's a problem when you try to do that on a Mac. Uh, Windows I often, uh, I, I, usually, I often don't have problems with Windows, but yes, I do with Mac. So I'll show you what the problem is. So if I right-click a table on uh, from uh, from the output of SPSS and try to uh, paste it into my Word document, it will not work. So copy, and I go there and then try to paste it. Uh, Control uh, V, or even try to right-click. It it doesn't work. Uh, so here's a workaround. Uh, you have you should have uh, your Word document open and uh, your uh, table open. And let's say I'm gonna type table one here, and then table will be placed right underneath that title. So I go uh, on Microsoft Word. I go uh, in Microsoft Word. I go to uh, insert, and then uh, under here. Uh, there's uh, an icon for you to take a screen clipping. Uh, it's out just outside of the, uh, just outside of. Let me let me change it a little bit here. Uh, make it uh, smaller so that you can see it. Uh, so insert. And uh, still you cannot see it. Um, but there's going to be an option after you click. Um, this is actually take a screenshot. So there's an option in Microsoft Word that allows you to take a screenshot. So if you click the drop down menu, you'll see all these options here. And then towards the bottom, you'll see screen clipping. You don't see that on your screen, but it should be there. So screen clipping, once you click there, uh, temporarily the Microsoft Word document will disappear. And basically, uh, the system is uh, expecting you to select um, uh, part of uh, any other screen that you see on your computer that you want to take a screenshot of. So in this case here, I want that table. I'm going to just do this. I just select, click, hold, drag, and, 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 and resize the box. And so that, that's exactly what I want. The tape is there. Uh, and then as you can see here, the, the document d appears again. A Microsoft Word document appears again. And I can resize the table the way I want. And there we have it. This is a workaround uh, to copy and paste tables, graphs from SPSS output into Microsoft Word when, when you are on a Mac machine. Um, and uh, probably they will fix this problem in the future, but if you encounter this problem, this is how you would eventually fix uh, and get the job done. Uh, I'll catch you later.